to the channel so today i'm here to do the test drive of the hero extreme and this one is in the 160 cc offering comes with a self and a so the hero extreme are the uh, new design of uh, hero new philosophy and this makes the bike very light just around 130 plus kgs because of this the bike is very nimble to drive and uh, is very spirited to drive uh, makes roughly around 15 plus bhp and uh, it's 41 mm fork and it comes with the rear suspension which is mono suspension with seven step adjustability open chain unit the sari guard is there and also this uh, i believe is the rare few 160s which come with a kick rod this bit of the frame starts from the front and goes almost to the center of the vehicle so that's there so now let's hear the exhaust note yep so a basic exhaust note ride review of the hero extreme r so this one is in the red color so the gray and red so i'm want to thank uh, bhagat uh, hero for uh, giving me this opportunity to do this review and uh, yes the hero extreme r most anticipated 160 cc vehicle in its class uh, from the hero stable mainly because of its lightweight construction and also the 160 cc powerful engine which is you know comes around with 15 plus bhp so so let's start the review stream are very very nimble to drive and a very you know agile vehicle the weight of this vehicle makes it you know one of the champs in the 160 cc uh, segment yep suspension is more to do on the comfort side uh, it has a very nice and a plus suspension and uh, yeah i guess what stands out of the, of the vehicle is the lightweight nature of the vehicle uh, in the first two gearing is really nice and uh, yep it uh, has very very street fighter kind of uh, look so i can easily hug the tank with this uh, uh, you know tank extensions uh, and uh, you know this makes it more and uh, the seat is also has very good padding and hence uh, you know it is perfectly contoured so that uh, you are uh, you know tucked into the bike so that also is nice again uh, the switch gear quality seems to be pretty decent uh, good job from hero and i can't believe that this vehicle is so light and so nimble to drive and it is making the ride uh, even more enjoyable a perfect city tourer i would say because uh, for a 160 where it's mostly spent the it's its life in the, the city and occasionally highway runs i guess this would be a perfect uh, bike because firstly lightweight uh, you know trellis frame and uh, that is uh, roughly around 134 kgs the engine is very refined and it has good power around 15 plus bhp which is really good the gearing also is really smooth and uh, it is really uh, you know built for the uh, city runs because the first two gearings are uh, for quick pickups and then later the other gears are for slightly on the highway cruising side the suspensions setup is in such a way that it has the uh, in the lower speeds it soaks up the bumps very well but when i'm going in the to give you a nice and a very uh, stable drive so that also is there the instrumentation console is a completely digital unit and uh, started raining are you serious why it started raining with braking test yep so the bite on the brakes is also really good I am at a standstill and I want to do the braking test just to check the the front brake uh, 
you know bite so from a standstill I believe this is around 50 and then it slammed on the brake yes so the ABS works very well and uh, yes it does the duty very well so that's also which is nice and uh, yep so it's a very compact and a very nimble bike to drive the fuel tank capacity I believe is around uh, 12 to 13 liters I will put the uh, uh, exact specification in the YouTube description notes and uh, mainly this bike is catered for people especially who want some enjoyment out of the 160cc category vehicles and this bike delivers in that front in all manners it is very light it is very powerful it has a refined engine the gearbox is really smooth it is only five speed but it is really smooth for uh, city runs and occasional highway uh, tours the instrumentation console and uh, the switchgear quality is also top notch it has the hazard switch so a rarity to see it in a 160cc vehicle and then the instrumentation console as i said it has a completely lcd unit and uh, that is uh, you know uh, the you know the, the highlight and it is a backlit unit and comes with single channel abs so pretty nice and uh, as you have seen the brake built uh, the brake uh, also the abs intervention is also not that uh, uh, sudden but it does the ju duty very well so all in all a very good package and i think the best bits of this vehicle also comes with the small touches that this vehicle offers and like or the provision for a kick rod because in nowadays 160 cc vehicles you get to see that the kick rod is not being provided so that is there and then uh, the other thing is that the silent starter motor uh, so that also is uh, uh, an interesting thing the all led treatment yes so this puts less load on the bike and it also illuminates the uh, uh, you know the the light throw very well and uh, so the front is all led unit the rear tail light is also all led unit so which is really good so these small touches certainly makes the bike very very appealing uh, and you know that's that's something which uh, uh, hero has you know learned out of their experience in this 150 to 150 cc uh, 160cc bikes that it has you know as good as this vehicle the icing on the cake that i would say is the price see i have looked at all the 160s especially like the other one that i was talking about is the hornet 160 that is roughly around 1 lakh 37,000 to 1 lakh 40 but this one is just 1 lakh 26,000 and this is the on road price that i'm talking about so for that price you get a lot of bike and heroes uh, doing uh, really well for the you know the price conscious buyer and uh, setting the vehicles exactly in the right price so that also is a nice thing uh, and kudos to hero for that so all in all a very good bike if you are looking for a uh, you know city commuter yes so you can see that you can perfectly you know chuck this bike and uh, you know you can throw it in a corner or it's very very nimble to drive and uh, you know the lightweight nature of the vehicle only you know adds to the overall driving pressure so that's something which uh, is the, the the highlight i would say yep so that was my ride review so let me get onto the highway and uh, let me do one more speed run and uh, they were really uh, very very approachable as well so that's nice and uh, yeah so it was a very nice review and very nice uh, bike to drive i hope you enjoy this video if you do so please like and subscribe to my channel this is kevin signing off and uh, yeah see you in the next one bye bye